Okay, YouTubers, I'm uh, on the outside looking in, and uh, before I wheel the uh, chicken mansion out to give you a better view of all I've done, I decided to uh, show you one of the last things I've done is to open an uh, entrance to the outside for the chickens. Uh, I'm going to give you a better look. when I wheel the whole thing out. But right now I'm going to show you a chicken eye view of the hole here, of the entranceway. This right here is the automatic door. It's going to seal off everything from the outside. Here, I'm going to put another uh, door right in here to cover this whole hole up and it'll be a lockable it'll be another thing that uh, Predators have to get through if they want to get to your chickens or our chickens or whatever so this is the uh, Bird's eye view And uh, I'm getting ready to wheel it out and show you How I covered it the bell roof, the sides, everything is almost completely finished. So hold on, I'll get right back to you. Here's another bird's eye view what the chickens see as they walk outside from the inside out. And I'm going to show you how I finished it off from the outside in. Right here is the entrance point. Between the, the bird's leg will be a chicken ramp. That's how they get in and get out. Now, like I promised you, I'm going to show you everything I've done since I put up my frame. I used a 50 year metal roof on this uh, particular coop. I used smart siding right here. Let's see if I give you a better look on this side. Matter of fact, uh, yesterday I christened it because we had a lot of rain coming in uh, yesterday and I didn't find no leaks nowhere. Right here is the inlet. Put a hose in here and the water falls through here and feeds the reservoir to feed the chickens or to water the chickens from the inside. This is a tall wall and on the tall wall is where I situated my uh, panels. Like I said, the copula isn't there just to look, give it character or look pretty. It's there to uh, be functional. Uh, it has lights coming through there and it's a ventilation on the whole thing. Uh, I'm going to show you how the door closes. I got a door within a door. Let me back it out a little bit. Door within a door. First that door closes, then we're going to close the people door. That's a general look. Of everything. One more time around, okay? When the water comes off the roof, it don't merely drop, it looks like it's kind of cascade, like it's, it pops off the roof. One day I'll show you. When we get another good rainstorm coming here. I'm going to close this up. Will you collect your eggs? 
back off a little bit and that's how she looked from the back. Getting ready to push her back in. Oh, right here, I forgot to show you. On this side is a faucet. Yeah, right, if you want to flush your system, sanitize your system, your water, you can do that and uh, you won't ever have to go inside the chicken coop ever unless you want to collect eggs or whatever and uh, one more thing if you like this shit please go to www readersheds co dot united kingdom dot they got a contest and I'm in it and I don't have the votes and I don't have Facebook, Facebook, Twitters, I have none of that and I need, need your votes if you can help me vote for me I appreciate it and uh, the next video will be how I hooked up and what kind of power I'm going to get out of my solar panels to fire this whole thing up. Because like I said, mainly this shit is going to be working off the sun. Not off AC. Hey people, thank you. Appreciate you. And please vote for me. Bye-bye. Take it easy.